Hi, I'm Corey from Hashed Health. This is the first of a new video series that we're putting together to explore the exciting work that we're doing to bring blockchain solutions to the healthcare industry. In this first video, we're going to address the most common question that we get asked still today, and that's what is blockchain? We hope this short and non-technical introduction to blockchain can help you understand why we're so excited about the potential for this new technology for our industry. Most simply, a blockchain is a transactional ledger. It records transactions, the movement of anything of value from one party to another. What makes blockchain unique is that it's a distributed ledger, which means a network of transactional partners can share a single copy of the ledger. But rather than having one copy of the ledger held by one centralized party, every transactional entity has their own copy of the ledger. And what's important to understand about blockchain is that the technical architecture solves the reconciliation problem. In other words, all copies of the ledger are in sync and in consensus with each other all the time, which removes the need to reconcile my copy of the ledger and your copy of the ledger, and it takes out inefficiencies in the transacting process. It's also a distributed ledger, which means that when we make a transaction, we broadcast that transaction to a network of transacting parties who all maintain copies of the ledger. Blockchain is a secure transactional layer in that transactions that get recorded in the ledger cannot be changed by any single party. Therefore, it's safe to be distributed among multiple transacting parties. We think that blockchain is a transformational technology for the healthcare industry. It is a technical architecture, not a simple piece of software, but solutions can be built to address the long-standing problems that we're familiar with in the healthcare industry. The fundamental problem in healthcare is called by many different names. On the clinical side, it can be termed the lack of interoperability, or revenue cycle problems on the payment side, or supply chain problems for the movement of pharmaceuticals and supplies across the healthcare industry. But all of these problems come down to one core issue, and that's transactional inefficiency. In healthcare, it's almost impossible to avoid transactional inefficiency. The provision of even the simplest procedure in healthcare triggers a transactional cascade of administrative transactions between multiple parties and stakeholders to deliver that care to a patient. Let's take prescriptions as an example. A physician writes you a very simple prescription for an antibiotic. Electronically issuing that prescription to you triggers a cascade of back-end administrative transactions before that drug ever reaches your hand. There'll be benefits investigation and eligibility checks to see if your insurance will cover that drug. There might be prior authorization or step therapy requirements to be checked to see if you're able to receive that drug or if other drugs might be preferred. There are formulary checks. There are maybe patient assistance determinations that take place. And then there's the supply chain of whether or not the pharmacy that you want to go to has that drug on hand and whether it's covered by your insurance. All of these administrative transactions take place in isolation from each other. The crucial data or finding from one transaction is not necessarily shared with those other administrative transactions. What this means for the patient is often bizarre and inexplicable delays in what should otherwise be a very simple provision of healthcare, the delivery of a drug. We've all had the experience of waiting in healthcare, whether it's at the doctor's office or the pharmacy. And those delays are mostly associated with transactional inefficiency. Past attempts to solve the problem of transactional inefficiency of healthcare have usually followed one of two routes. Either healthcare enterprises are forced to build brittle, one-off digital connections with transactional partners that often break or unreliable or simply can't move the data in a secure fashion where it needs to go. Or we move the data through a third party, a middleman, whose sole purpose is to securely move data from point A to point B across the healthcare continuum adding cost and further inefficiency to these transactional processes. But blockchain can offer us a new path forward. This digital architecture would allow multiple transacting parties in healthcare to securely share a transactional ledger. And when we talk about transaction, we want to get poetic. Transactions can mean the movement of anything of value, whether that's money, data, valuable goods, or high value assets. Doesn't matter what the transaction is, Blockchain can securely communicate the movement of that data, the movement of that digital asset between multiple parties. And because it's a distributed ledger, 
Blockchain allows multiple enterprises to have real-time transparency into the state of these complex healthcare transactions. Whether it's a pharmaceutical contract to move drug from manufacturer to distributor to retail pharmacy, or whether it's a complex document like a medical claim, which requires a range of data, both from the health system side and from the insurance side, or whether or not it's simply a matter of getting your medical records from one provider to another provider without resorting to the ubiquitous fax machine in healthcare. Blockchain becomes that common transactional layer that sits between multiple transacting enterprises and it takes out a lot of the inefficiencies and pain points that we all experience in the delivery of healthcare. We are excited about the potential for blockchain applications in healthcare. It's early days still though, and we are hard at work developing solutions. We encourage you to visit hashthelp.com to learn more about the use cases that we're building right now and to get more information on how your enterprise can get involved in the blockchain revolution.